Hey guys, I'm back with one more video. Uh, this is HP EliteBook 8470P. So the problem with this one is when you turn it on, as you can see, the error pops up. The system has detected that a cooling fan is not operating correctly. Error is system fan 90B, as you can see. But if you hit enter, it would con allow you to continue to the startup. So it would work. But uh, if you want to get rid of this error, I can show you how we can do that. So first thing we'll do is turn off this laptop. Flip this over. Here is the release button. If you want to open the back cover, as you can see this one, just slide that to the right. This one is for the battery. If you want to remove that, you can take it out if you want to. Just slide it to the right and pull it out gently. There we go. So here's the cooling fan that we are getting error for. So all we need to do is uh, remove that uh, cooling fan, clean it up a little bit, and let's see if that uh, take care of that issue. So mostly what happens, some dust uh, builds in over the time, and it's not allowing fan to work properly that it's supposed to. So we'll just remove this, I mean, lose these two screws that, as you can see, I did the first one, here's the second one. It's not going to come out all the way, but just, uh, you would feel it, it's loose now. The third one is the cable. As you can see, these are the cables. It's plugged in over there. So all you need to do is pull it up gently. There we go. And now I'm gonna lift it up and just pull it down, slide it to your right. Takes a little bit of time, but eventually you would be able to open it. There we go. As you can see, this is the fan, and here's the dust. As you can see, it's built up over the time, so we just need to remove that, clean it up. So that's what was causing the issue. I have air spray I'm going to use to just clean it up gently. Alright, once we are done with that, we're going to take a look at the fan. Here is the fan. And we're just going to clean that in mind as well. That's all we need to do, just make sure both hands are clean and we're just going to reverse the process now, we're just going to plug it back in. So I'm going to move it, uh, slide it in gently. So once we are done with that, we're going to lock the back cover in, plug the battery in, lock that one in, and turn it on, and let's see what we get. Here you go. So when we turn on the PC, it used to come right away. But now, let's see, yeah, we don't see that error no more. You can see this is going through the startup process. So this is how you can fix the system fan error issue. Thank you guys, thanks for watching. I hope this video helps you resolve the issue.